Hallelujah. I've entitled this message, The Hope of the Kingdom of God. Perhaps you know someone who does not take correction kindly. It may be because that person does not recognize the power that's in the heart surgery that only Dr. Jesus can perform. Well, God has a remedy, and to provide us with his remedy, God sent his way of making mankind like he is. Jesus is God's way of making mankind like God, and Jesus says, quote, I tell you the truth, no one can see the kingdom of God unless he is born again. We find that evidence, and I read it from the New International Version in John chapter 3, verse 3 of the Holy Bible. So you see, the remedy is the Lord Jesus, and the Lord Jesus describes the remedy as being born again. So if you never been born again, but you want to see the kingdom of God and you trust that Jesus is the one that God sent, then you can be born again right now where you are. Because Jesus is risen from the dead by the glory and the power of God. Never to die again. And all you need to do is pray this prayer with me. And just repeat the words after me and mean it in your heart. And if God sees in your heart that you are sincere, then he'll baptize you right where you are right now in the Holy Ghost. So let us pray. If, if you have never received Jesus, but you want to now, because receiving Jesus according to the scripture is the way to be born again. And if you want to be born again, that is to say, if you want to see the kingdom of God and you trust that Jesus came from God, delivering the message from God, then let us pray this prayer. Bow your hearts with me and repeat these words after me. Say, Dear God in heaven, I am a sinner and I come seeking your forgiveness through Jesus Christ. I confess that Jesus is Lord. And I believe Jesus is risen from the dead by your glory and your power, Father God. Now I surrender to you, Lord Jesus, and I ask you to come by the Holy Spirit and live your life through me. Thank you, Father, for saving me. Thank you for your tender mercies. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. Father in heaven, I thank you that you've heard the prayer of this person who prayed this prayer with me. And I thank you that you have made the increase because it's true that the Lord made it happen and you, Father God, made the increase. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Well, to God be the glory if you prayed that prayer with me, then I tell you the truth, not just my word, but take God's word that you have been born again. And in order to find that word, look at the evidence that's recorded in John chapter number uh, 1 and verses 11, 12, and 13. This is the evidence where God is giving you his word because you have received Jesus Christ, that you are among those that, because you have received Jesus Christ according to the scripture, rather, you are among those whom God testifies and says, you are now born again. So be encouraged. Now you can live according to that truth because God has given you that hope. And you be encouraged if the Lord is willing. I'll talk to you again at another time. Hallelujah.
God is good. He lives forever. He's a stronghold in the day of trouble. I say, My God is good. Oh, yes, He lives forever. He's a stronghold in the day of trouble. I sing it again. My God is good. Oh, yes, He lives forever. He's a stronghold in the day of trouble. Thank you, Jesus. You're a stronghold in the day of trouble. That trust in the Lord, they shall be like Mount Zion, that can never be moved but abide forevermore. I said, Did that trust in the Lord, they shall be like Mount Zion, they can never be moved but they shall abide forevermore. Come on, I sing, my God is good. He lives forever. He's a stronghold in the day of trouble. My God is good. He lives forever. He's a stronghold in the day of trouble. When you are faced with a very high mountain, just Call on Jehovah, call upon Jehovah. I said, call upon Jehovah, call upon Jehovah, because He's a stronghold in the day of trouble. Are you tired in this life? Just call upon Jehovah, because He's a stronghold. In the day of trouble My God is good He lives forever He's a stronghold In the day of trouble When you are very weak and weary And it seems no one cares Just call upon Jehovah I said call upon Jehovah Call upon Jehovah. I say, call upon Jehovah because he's a stronghold in the day of trouble. Yes, Lord, for a stronghold in the day of trouble. I am grateful to you, Lord. Thank you for making me yours. Thank you, Jesus. In the secret place of the Most High Shall abide under the shadow Under the shadow of the Most High God Under the shadow of the Almighty Under the shadow of the Almighty Shall abide under the shadow Under the shadow of the Almighty Under the shadow of the Almighty Under the shadow of the Almighty Shall I bat under the shadow? Under the shadow of the mountain.